Hello. So now I'm going to just talk a very short talk about um, what is complexity in software engineering. Okay. I think it is important before we start because actually is uh, to see what are the type of problems we are addressing. And the best way to look at it is to see what is uh, complexity in computer science and then to see if there's differences between what we address in computer science and in software engineering. So why is software complex? So from the point of view of uh, the computer science disciplines, we have uh, addressing uh, intrinsic, intrinsic complexity. Okay? So when you solve problems like a traveling a salesman problem, uh, so the problem by itself is, is complex and uh, uh, you need to, to apply techniques that you learn in algorithms, for instance, to solve that problem, okay? But uh, when you do software engineering, when you have large projects, the type of complexity we have to address is we have a lot of functionalities. You can have um, hundreds or thousands of functionalities. You can have millions of lines of code and you have teams that are large and that can be hundreds of people or thousands of people. Uh, developing the system and so in that size so when you address what you are addressing is techniques to deal with size okay so actually you may solve in being solving in your system complex problems from the computer science point of view and at the same, at the same time you need you have the additional complexity of the number of features that are involved when are, you are solving these or the number of people that is involved uh, on this. Of course, what usually happens to deal with this is that usually you, when you have your project, you identify the complex parts from the computer science point of view. You try to isolate them in small teams or small groups, uh, so, sorry, small teams or uh, small modules okay, of code. And then you have these people address that complexity in a uh, smaller scope and you apply software engineering techniques to deal with the connection between all the, the scopes, the connection between people, the connection of this complexity problem, intrinsic complexity problem with all the functionality you have to develop. So, we are going to talk in the future, actually, is this problem about uh, how do I manage teams that are very large? How do I develop software that has hundreds of thousands of functionalities? How do I uh, manage code that has that code that is changed by hundreds of, hundreds of people at the same time with a lot of versions? So that's the type of techniques we are going to address. And we'll discover that it's a difficult thing, okay? Because there's a, a lot of different things that you need to deal. So it's not trivial. And you're going to learn techniques and tools and methods to deal with that. Okay? Thank you.